The issue on the Anglophone piece, I won't go into detail on that. I think the article plus the video this morning did a very good job of explaining the history of how it got to the point where we are today. In uh, October of 2017, when, when it came kind of to a head, the Anglophone states said we, we want to actually form our own state, the Amazonia state. Uh, there have been issues there with uh, atrocities, issues with uh, allegations of, of uh, law of war um, issues, and uh, this is something that uh, it brings all this to a head. Uh, over the last several months or so, the State Department has put on hold several uh, security force assistance programs. Uh, so right before the election in October, I, with the ambassador, went and paid a visit with President Bia, and we had a very direct conversation with him with regards to investigation of these atrocities, transparency of these atrocities, and appropriate battlefield behavior. Uh, since that time, the State Department has made a decision not to uh, allocate significant money, but at the same time they've released some money that's been on hold to things like Scan Eagle and Cessna aircraft that assist in the Boko Haram fight in the north. We still have programs that we continue with them, all kind of small engagements as well as exercises. Uh, we did have, a, we talked about the state partnership program with Nebraska. We put that on hold and uh, in conjunction with the, with the ambassador, AFRICOM, we decided not to pursue that because it wouldn't have been a, a good place for that particular group to be, so we put a halt to that. So the bottom line is right now in, uh, in Cameroon, they have been a good partner with us counterterrorism-wise, but you can't neglect the fact that they have <laughs> Uh, there, there are alleged, alleged atrocities and what's going on there. And so we continue to take our cues from the State Department and from the Ambassador, and our level of engagement will continue but not get out ahead of what the State Department would say is uh, if we have to take other actions. We were very emphatic with President Bia that the behavior of his troops, the lack of transparency, could have a significant impact on our ability to work with them. Great.